Konnichiwa YouTubers, this is Red Stock straight from Point Magoo, California, just north of Malibu if you want to find it. Yeah, <laughs> this is actually goes out to my boy Tackleberry, big fan from way back, so here you go. Sorry, I'm not going to show you dark side, but at least a part, I'm going to tease you. But enough about that, let's go ahead and take a look at the package. DC Universe, 75th, DC Comics 75th, actually comes with a cool collector button, I'll show you that right now so you can see. There we go, look at that, collector button with a flash and whoever knows, uh, golden age figures, I don't know. That's alright. Okay, there's your collector button, warnings, you can see in the background. Okay, DC Universe, I don't know if you can make out the figures in the background, Shazam and whatnot. Collect, co collect and connect figure, CNC, dark side, and I, I hear he's badass. Here's the seven figures you need to collect them. I got iron. He's actually wave 12 figure 7. So he's a little older than you uh, You know. This is good old iron in the back. DC Comics 75. There's a biography if you want a Will Magnus. So there you go. Yada, yada, yada. Okay, first appearance. Magnus Labs. Yada, yada, yada. Okay. You know, he's a shapeshifter. Yay. Enough about that. Let's go ahead and look at the figure. I'm, I'm digging this figure. It has a little man symbol on the top here. So, look at the, uh, I love the way that is looking, molded ears over here, the little skull cap, look at the eyebrows, he has good attention to details, nose, ridges, lips, it's pretty damn good, I'm not going to lie to you, I like that. There's a man symbol over here, Iron Man, I don't know what they're going for here, so, has not bad articulation, I love the coloring, the gold, or blue metallic. The skirt over here made out of nice hard plastic. All right, pretty good detailing on the legs. It's kind of nondescript. The paint, I like the middle, not as not descript as others, but not bad nonetheless. So you got the rivets. So, but it lacks some paint apps. It, it makes up with good detailing. So I like it. I like it. I show you articulation real quick. Head is on a ball joint, so you can make it swivel. Does swivel 360, limited by the collar, of course. Uh, I don't think I can take this off without ripping it apart. Ball jointed shoulder, um, also on a swivel, swivel joint on bicep, single jointed elbow, wrist swivel. That's kind of like a hinge swivel. All right, does have ab crunch. If it not, of course, it is limited because of the chain mail. Does have a waist swivel good on it again limited hip is on a hinge rather than a ball joint so I'm not digging that so I can only go side to side and go upside actually it does seem to swivel a bit so we'll give it that part wish it was on a ball joint like good old uh, dark side oh by the way it comes with dark sides right legs so that's the only part you're gonna get sorry tackle Barry that's all you get <laughs> there we go I'm oh, sorry left leg I'm pretty sure it says there left leg whatever all right, thigh swivel, not bad. Single jointed knee and an ankle pivot joint. So it's looking pretty good. And it comes with a few extras too. So let me go ahead and point that out. It stands up pretty well, so I'm digging it. On the left leg, or sorry, left fist comes with this big mace. So you can swing it around, yeah. And the right wrist comes with, there you go, adjustable wrench. Actually adjusts, so that's kind of cool. Not a not bad little extras, kind of makes him top heavy. And to tell you the truth, this is the only die cast that I'm aware of is this chain right here. So don't get excited. Stands up pretty well. Gonna give him seven half out of ten here. Let me show you for a size comparison, so you can kind of make out. This is creepy Japanese girl, no eyes. <laughs> so you can tell he's a little bit bigger than a six inch figure, so about six and a half inches. And here he is next to G.I. Joe. Yeah. Alright YouTubers, that's all I got. And I'll catch y'all next time.